The United States Constitution gives the Senate the power to expel any member by a two-thirds vote. This is distinct from the power over impeachment trials and convictions that the Senate has over executive and judicial federal officials. The Senate concluded in 1798 that senators could not be impeached, but only expelled, while conducting the impeachment trial of William Blunt, who had already been expelled. Expulsion has not occurred since the Civil War, which most of the expulsions were related to, although this is partly because many members resign rather than face a formal proceeding when expulsion appears possible. Censure, a lesser punishment which represents a formal statement of disapproval, has been more common in the 19th century. Although censure carries no formal punishment, only one senator Benjamin R. Tillman of the nine to be censured has ever been re-elected, unlike the House of Representatives, which also disciplines by reprimand, a censure is the weakest form of discipline the Senate issues. <laughs> <laughs> Expelled senators Expulsion proceedings not resulting in expulsion Many expulsion proceedings have been begun by the Senate that did not lead to expulsion. In most cases, the expulsion failed to secure the necessary two-thirds vote, in other cases the senator in question resigned while proceedings were taking place. In a few cases, the proceedings ended when a senator died or his term expired. Censured senators See also List of New York legislature members expelled or censured Censure in the United States List of federal political scandals in the United States List of federal political sex scandals in the United States Federal politicians List of United States representatives expelled, censured, or reprimanded List of American federal politicians convicted of crime state and local politics List of American state and local politicians convicted of crimes Notes <laughs>